everybody. Now we are in the third level, third category of CGL games uh, divisions. That means this is advanced level. We are uh, introducing the scrappling concept. It's, uh, the scrappling is what you've seen before, body striking with takedown and with submission grappling. So what this means is that two people start with striking the body, punching, kicking the body, kicking the leg, and they can take each other down. After the takedown, either they can stand up, it's up to them, or they choose to submission grapple. That means there's no strikes on the floor. They go into a flow, submission grappling. Uh, they can choke, hold, lock uh, each other. If one person does not like to be on the ground, he or she can stand up. One person likes the ground, they, they want to take the other person down. That's their prerogative. But in the scrappling category, we have striking, we have takedown, and we have flow submission grappling on the ground. Uh, there is no uh, head technique, no head kicks, no elbows, no knees to the body or to the legs. They are required to wear MMA gloves, padded four ounce minimum MMA gloves, mouthpiece, groin protector of course, shin pads, and uh, striking to the body only, striking to the leg. There are no straight stomping kicks to the knees, only curved kicks inside and outside of the legs. All right, so let me uh, ask uh, the gentleman to demonstrate. Welcome back, everybody. Once again, I have Professor Jason Solis and Sensei Chow. They are going to demonstrate the scrappling category, scrappling uh, for the CGL Combative Games League Advanced Division. Uh, bow to each other, gentlemen. Guard position and begin. Inside leg kick, outside leg kick, curve kicks. Striking to the body, kicking to the body. He takes down, takes down allowed. Now there's no striking on the ground. They can continue to grapple. They can continue. He chooses not to grapple, stands up. The match goes on. Do it. Takedown happens again. They continue to grapple. You can do submission, you can do arm bar, and tap. So, Mr. Chow tapped, that means he submitted. Uh, Mr. Professor submitted Chow, and uh, end of the match. Now, the match doesn't have to end with the submission, it can end with striking also, it can end with no decision also. So, if there's no decision, they will get another round for final decision. Okay, and we'll detail the rules later on uh, in, in another post. Thank you, John.